Hey, what's up, universe? It is 8.49 a.m. on Friday, May 5th, 2023. That's really natural for me to do because that's exactly how I start every single audio journal. <laughs> um, just a few random things to kind of post today. So last night I turned in my, my old Android, uh, dropped it in the mail. It was 9.09 p.m. Uh, if any of you follow numbers and things like that. Um, I always keep an eye on the time uh, just because I'm curious and just the way that I, I believe that the universe participates with us, that we receive messages in an invariable number of ways, like just infinite. Uh, anyway, so I dropped the phone off, so that's been released. I <laughs> happen to be blessed very much so with... Uh, you can see I'm not in a hotel today. I am uh, was able to secure a room at, at an Airbnb, um, just barely, you know. Uh, the host forgot to uh, turn off accepting uh, reservations. I think I placed the reservation around almost 9 p.m. It was like maybe 12 hours ago, around 8.50 p.m. Yeah, so that's... Um, <laughs> I'm very grateful. <clears throat> very grateful. Um, so then I will be heading back out to the library today for some good old internet access. Today is my last day. Um, I spent like an hour, maybe 90 minutes crafting my, my uh, kind of farewell message to the team last night and sent that, sent that out because uh, there's a lot of love for uh, the people that I work with. Um, so it's, a, it's definitely a bittersweet thing. Uh, it seemed like there may have been some salient points that I wanted to make, but more or less it's just a quick update about where I'm at right now. Um, nothing's coming to my mind that seems to be utterly profound. Uh, but I am grateful, and today's the 5th, and we're going into the weekend. We're going to see what's up. Yeah. There is part of me, I'll go ahead and admit this, because this is, this is... This is vulnerable. <laughs> this is vulnerable. Okay. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna admit I may be one of the people that you know that has had one of the shortest marriages that you've ever heard of. I got married on October 22nd, 2022. Uh, my divorce was final on March 27th, 2023. <laughs> like, like final, not like I petitioned or filed. Like, no, we had the court date. The judge was there. Marriage was terminated. <laughs> um, I mentioned this because, um, just to provide some context, there is a friend of mine here in town who really helped me out, uh, when I returned back to Kansas city and she, is also going through something similar, very much so. And so I checked in with myself around this last night, actually over the last few days, just kind of seeing where I was at, where it was coming from, as far as maybe reaching out to her because she's been posting on Facebook and things like this. I haven't been commenting. I've just been kind of, you know, watching from the background because I'm still evaluating where I'm at. How do I feel? Where are some of the feelings that I'm feeling coming from? Uh, cause you know, like that's a big deal for me understanding where that's understanding that cause any move that I make now, um, just really needs to be in it, intentional and evaluated as far as how aligned it is. That's part of the reason I wasn't commenting and everything. So I spoke with her for about 20 minutes last night, uh, over the phone and it was good to catch up and it was good to check in with myself uh, as that conversation was happening. Because, um, I mean, it's... But for me, I know it's like a month after the divorce, and I've been married before, so this is my second divorce, and my metabolization of this energy is much different than it was the first divorce. And I'm not, I'm not going to say that I'm, I'm still not processing stuff, because obviously I am, which is part of the reason if not the main reason, I was like, okay, what would be, what's actually causing me to reach out? What's causing me to, you know, like 
maybe connect um, or reconnect or just kind of just... I haven't talked to her in a while, so obviously that's what I mean by reconnecting. So I was just checking in with all of that, and that's still that's still a process. Um, so I'm just putting that out there because I'd be totally lying if I wasn't exploring ideas uh, and thoughts in my head, you know, just everything that's changing, the house. I mean, like I said, we're going through some very similar things. And, you know, there's part of me... And this is why I check in with myself, because there is a part of me that I wasn't really being very mindful of before, which was the part of me that would see potential and like a frickin addict would just recklessly abandon with reckless abandon, just chase after that. Uh, and I have learned recently that such modes of operation <laughs> are not necessarily in alignment with where I'm looking and intending to go. So I'm just putting that all out there that that is that's that is a thing. Um that that's a thing. <laughs> all right. So there you go. That's my vulnerable share for now. All right. I'll, I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Uh, here we go. Bye. <laughs>